So yeah, now I'm headed to this uh, this NBA hoop part because uh, Kyrie, Kyrie Joe or Jow, I don't know, I don't know how to say his last name. He going to this the Stephon Marbury NBA camp. So we're gonna check that joint out, see what's really going on. He said uh, he said Marbury be popping up at like three, and it's fortunate because this joint just happened to be right next to where I got class and all that. So. Hopefully I can meet uh, Stefan Marbury. I remember back in the day, like seventh grade, I remember I had my um, my own little personal strawberries back in the day. People that's my age, if y'all remember the strawberries and y'all done been through it. Y'all couldn't afford the Nikes. Took you to the mall, Potomac Mills, and got the strawberries. Them Jones. I had like some orange and blue ones too. Let's go check it out. See y'all in a little bit. Yeah, I ain't never been to these parts. I swear, like, just going right around the corner from where I'm usually at just makes, like, China look so beautiful. I always say China, like, as if China's like a city or something like that, but it's tough. It's real hot out here. I guess y'all know, um, so like, because they don't be trying to rock with the sun, like they don't like, you know what I'm saying, tans, like how we do in the U.S., or well, how white people do in the U.S. Um, so they wear like, not wear, but they take umbrellas everywhere whenever it's hot. So they ain't gotta worry about it. They ain't gotta worry about their skin getting darker because they take that real serious over here. because I'm the only foreigner out this jump. Probably don't think I'm Kevin Durant. Boy, if you don't... So even better. LeBron James. NBA hoop party. This one is... Uh, let me make sure I got my translator out. I'm like, yeah, uh... I'm with Mr. Marbury. I'm his eighth cousin. Twice the move. Oh, oh, okay. They gotta have MJ up there. I'm Karibu. What's your name? Eric. 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 Okay, I'm Ken. Nice to meet you, Ken. Right, nice to meet you. So, you got a number? Can I have your number? Yeah. yeah. You have uh... You have a wedge? Yeah. I'm uh... Um, Okay. Yeah, you know, nice. uh, training kids. Okay. Play basketball. Wow. Maybe we can uh, talk about this. Yeah. Uh, oh, Eric. Eric Shaw. Yes. Yeah. We got a Shaw TV in Canada. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Because uh, my mom is in Canada. Okay. Yeah, my wow. kids and my, my, my wife is in Canada. Oh, wow. Yeah. My, 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 I'm local. Oh, local? Yeah. 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 Right here. Okay. Loki, they think I'm in the NBA.
Marbury camp, it was lit. It was uh, it was a little different than what I expected. I thought it was gonna be something completely different, but it was still it was still pretty cool. They really only did it. It was only for like two hours. Man, they started going crazy when he walked in that Jones. So for those of y'all that don't know, like Stephon Marbury was, you know, what I'm saying he's a New York legend. He uh, played for the Knicks. He played for the Nets. Um, played for the Phoenix Suns. Then he came over here to Beijing. And I guess because he was putting mad numbers over here, they just started like worshiping him like out of nowhere. Like he was getting so much love. And I heard like when I was in the US, I heard that they um, that they made like a, they built like a statue for him. And so you can already tell, like if they built a statue for him in Beijing, it's it's lit. And uh, so yeah, it was a great experience. I met this one dude that works for like um, one of the top clubs, like basketball clubs and, and Wuxi. Yeah, it was cool. Everybody was coming to me thinking I was in like the NBA or something like that, taking pictures. The good thing about this situation was that everybody like actually asked, oh, can we take a picture with you? Can we take a picture with you? And then they uh, shook my hands like, oh, thank you, thank you. Uh, nice to meet you, this, that, and the other. And that was like pure love. Um, so it wasn't even the fact that people wanted pictures, but it was the fact like that they asked, you know what I'm saying? And really they didn't even care whether I was in the NBA or not. They probably assumed I was or something, but it was still cool just, you know, being in that atmosphere, basketball atmosphere, and it was nothing but love, you know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, I was surprised, surprised I ain't signed the autographs in that jump. But it was it was real cool, man. Um, shout out to Stefan Marbury, Starberry. That was lit. He seemed like a real humble dude. Um, that's the first time I ever seen him in person. Um, I didn't get a picture with him because I didn't want to seem like a groupie. But at the same time, it was all good. Like when he walked in, he looked at me, he was like, like, what's up? Because it was literally like me, him, the one dude that was training. And so yeah, it was literally like three black people in there. But um, yeah, he definitely showed a lot of love to the, you know, the Chinese people, all the kids and all that. But it was cool, man. So I'm gonna go meet Babe. She had the spa right now. Y'all know how boozy she be. She, she's super boozy. She then got hooked on this little spa, but they, they are doing like a bunch of different stuff for her skin. Like, uh, you know, helping her out and she going through all this Chinese skin treatment stuff. But yeah, it's cool. So I'm about to go meet up with her and we'll see where the night takes us from there. But yeah, I appreciate y'all watching. I hope y'all enjoyed. I know it's been a while. Um, as far as like uploading content and all that, but I appreciate for the, I appreciate the people that, you know, what I'm saying, still sticking with us, are like through all all like 11 of our subscribers, but um, yeah, we're really just doing this for fun, just to share this journey with with y'all, and we're learning more about it. But yeah, I'm excited to see what's next, and peace, love y'all. <laughs>